Morning. I just want to do an update on my lemon tree. So my lemon tree last year was putting up a bunch of water sprouts and it was a pretty small tree and it was just putting long water sprouts in every direction. And the year before that I did the same thing. And like people told me, I just cut them off and I wasn't getting any growth on my main branches. And again, the next year, lots of water sprouts. And so I decided, hey, maybe I should stop listening to what other people are telling me and just do an experiment. And so I let the water sprouts go until they're about six or seven feet tall. And then I just cut them on the tips. I just cut them down, left them at seven feet tall. And this happened with, I don't know, probably like seven or eight water sprouts. And I just cut them all at about eight feet tall. The main branches of the tree had stopped growing. And I think it's because the apical meristems has gotten damaged. Basically what that means is the part of the tree that is gonna put forth new growth, for whatever reason, stopped doing that on the lemon tree behind me. And this tree was probably only up to my shoulders or less. And now it's a good 14 feet tall in every direction because I allowed the water sprouts to go. And the water sprouts are covered with lemons and these lemons taste amazing. So I know I hear stories about people telling me that you can't grow quality lemons on water sprouts on lemon trees. And maybe I have a special lemon tree. Maybe Meyer lemons are different than whatever type of lemon tree some people have. But from my experience, let those things go until they're a little over your head and then just cut them on the tips so that they branch out and you'll get lots of fruit. So leave those water sprouts. Just want to show a close up of the tree with all the lemons on the lemons on the water sprouts. There's just tons of them. You can see the contrast because most of them are still greenish. And then, of course, wood chips help with production. But yeah, there looks like there's a few lemon, a few yellow ones that I could probably pick off if I wanted to. A lot of times I just wait for them to fall. When they get to about this yellowness, they'll just fall right off the tree. And I'm out here every day, so at least for a few minutes. Just to walk around because it's my own little paradise back here. This is my wood pile that I'm standing on. I have like five feet of wood chips that are covered with mushrooms right now. But yeah, all my fruit trees love having these partially decomposed wood chips at their bases. They just go nuts. Lots of nutrients. So let those water sprouts go. Just cut them on the ends.